Good morning, guys. It's me, Mia. So, um, let me get it off the like stair. Good morning, guys. It's me, Mia. So, it's Wednesday. Um, I had my second interview yesterday on Tuesday, and they asked me to come back today for a working interview so i'm gonna be working from 7 55 um until uh lunchtime so they can see like what i can do my different skills and everything um of course i'm nervous because it's literally been four years since i've worked in a patient's mouth but i feel like it's like riding a bike so although i may not be as fast as I used to be which we'll see once I update you guys um I feel like I know the I know what I'm doing so I should be fine I'm nervous and literally like my interview yesterday I was in there for an hour and a half and the doctor he was so amazing like this is why I want them to offer me like I feel like they are gonna offer me the position um because I was in there so long and we just had like a good vibe the doctor was really 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 nice and good looking um he you could tell he really knows his stuff like and I feel like I can learn so much from him. Initially, I thought I was going to take the first offer that I was offered. But the factors that weigh in are travel. Like, it's, of course, in a different city. But it's going to take me over an hour every morning to get to work. Whereas, for me to get to this place that I'm going to, this doctor's office, it would only take me 30 minutes 45 minutes max if that yes um, i'm gonna be working a little bit later but i go into work a little bit later which is gonna be nice and they have fridays off which is amazing so i will only have to work four days a week they have great benefits i'm gonna be making good money um if i when i'm gonna say it, i'm claiming it when i get the position um and hopefully i'll be able to start um once we come back from vacation which i'm gonna let her know um today like once they offer me the position um, i'm so I early guys that i stopped at dunkin donuts to get me iced coffee since i'm literally like so early like I I could not sleep last night like I just was like so excited like this is good this gonna make your teeth fall out I said extra cream and sugar but they really really put like the whole thing of sugar in it it's good but yeah I was looking at their pros and cons and I was thinking about the future like with the other place um although they made me an offer um and i was like i was contemplating like i'm so glad i went to my interview yesterday because i was contemplating well i already got this job offer so maybe i should just take it but then when i met with um the doctor and the office manager yesterday they changed like they're doing everything that i want to do like the practice that i went to on monday they're they do braces but they don't do as much they do a lot of like invisalign and like really high tech and i'm like like the doctor said yet that um i met with yesterday he was like i'm real old school like yeah we have like advanced technology and stuff like that we do some invisalign but not a lot of it um we do traditional braces we do banding we do all all that stuff all the stuff that i want to do that i'm good at so i was like okay cool so today is the day i had to pull my hair back um when i come back from vacation i'll probably have my hair like and like in these braids until the end of the week and then i'm taking them out because i don't like i don't know if it's just me but i don't like working with braids i like wearing my natural hair 
wanted to share this journey with you guys like i got up so early i got my baby ready my husband told me this morning he's like babe i'm so proud of you he said you're gonna have a good day he said i know you're nervous i can tell you didn't sleep and he said but you're gonna do good you're gonna do well it's like now as transitioning from a stay-at-home mom to a working mom but let me tell y'all this i'm gonna tell y'all this real quick i am so excited to go on vacation ah uh, let me say that again i am so excited to go on vacation and i'm gonna enjoy every bit of it because yeah, girl gonna be working soon but i'm i am so like excited i'm finally home um today went really really well like really well um i had my working interview as i talked about earlier in the vlog and before i left i got hired <laughs> yes thank you lord i got the job um they hi basically hired me on the spot. They're excited. The doctor is excited to have me a part of the team. They love my personality. All the girls were really nice and guys because we actually have a guy orthodontic assistant, which is really cool. I haven't I haven't seen that before, but that's really cool. Um, and I basically just work today. Like I showed like. It's been so long since I've worked, so I was afraid I wasn't gonna remember everything, but seriously, like, it was like riding a bike. I was just putting wires in and putting ties on and um, cleaning instruments was pretty easy. That's always pretty easy. Um, and the first person I called was my husband and told him that I got the job. Like, I literally was getting ready to cry because I, like I said, I've been out of work for so long, like, I didn't know if they were going to give me a chance. And they gave me a chance, and I'm going to be the best employee I can be. I'm going to try to catch on fast and learn what I can. Sorry, and they were actually calling me right now. Um, but I'm excited to, like I said, to work and be back in the swing of things. And um, I just basically... For me to learn something or to do something, I have to be, like, I have to be hands-on. And so I was like, well, can I do it? Can I do it? And I think they liked that I took initiative and was ready to work and ready to do what um, I had to do, basically. So I'm excited for this new beginning adventure. And I start after my vase. I'm getting all these messages in. I start after um, our vacation, so yes, I'm gonna go live my best life, and then when I come back, I'm gonna be ready to work, make make that money, and work on patience and stuff. So um, I really do owe this to God. Like I could cry. I I owe everything that I am and everything that I have and everything to God, and. I'm so thankful for my husband who has never complained once about me and not working, who has basically held down everything financially for our family for the last four years and has done a phenomenal job. And I'm excited, I'm ecstatic to be able to contribute financially for my family. Life. I can do it. I know I can. So thank you, Jesus. Thank you, husband. Thank you, family. Thank you to everybody who, you know, supports my decision to go back to work. And, you know, I'm just doing, as moms, I'm going to say this too, as moms, we do what we feel is best for our families, whether it's to stay at home and take care of everything, whether it's going to work and helping, you know, financially and still having to take care of everything, whether we're doing school to better ourselves with education so that we can have better jobs because I've done school. I'm going to finish school too eventually. But as moms, I feel like it's so important for us to stick together it doesn't matter what you do for your family as long as you're doing what you have to do for your family. So 
if you're a stay-at-home mom, stay encouraged because I have been there. I have have done that and now I'm getting ready to be a working mom so I'm excited to see where this goes where it leads I know I'm only going I know that I'm only going to do well and go up from here so thank you guys so much for watching and supporting and I know I just like basically talked this whole entire video but I love y'all you know what I'm saying I love y'all so I will see you guys probably after my vacation so this will be the last vlog until the vacation vlog so I will see you guys soon if you guys want me I want to wait until I'm I've been in the company for a little while before I start like vlogging like my like where I work and you know my chair and all of that stuff I want to make sure that I'm in good first so <laughs> I hope you guys understand that too so I will see you guys in the next vlog. Thanks so much for watching. Don't forget to comment, like, subscribe. And if you're not already, follow me on Instagram. It's all things Mia Joy right now. Follow me. Hit that button. Follow me. And um, you can stay updated because I'll make sure that I'm posting on my Insta stories and stuff. So I'll see you guys soon. Bye.